Hi, I'm Jason Bonnard. I'm the Brand Serp Guy, and today we're looking at the Brand Serp for the Brand Serp Guy. Now, it's understood that the Brand Serp Guy is a pseudonym for Jason Bonnard, that's me, which is delightful. I've got the feature snippet, I've got the description from my own site, that's a lot of control, and that's great. Underneath, we've got some videos all about me as the Brand Serp Guy, talking about Brand Serps. One of them down there is Don't Panic, It's Organic. That actually comes from my own site. What's really cool there is that we've beaten YouTube at its own game. Uh, that video is actually on YouTube, but we've re-embedded it into my own site. And Google is showing that instead of the YouTube one, which is great. So you can get your site into those video boxes at the expense of YouTube if you work it right. Next, we've got our, my own site. Then we've got these images. That one on the left is one of the experiments I'm currently running to see if I can influence which images actually appear. And that was a new image I created for the Brand Serp guy specifically. Uh, that was a couple of weeks ago. And Google's already taken it as being the most important image for the Brand Serp guy. Now, that wasn't the point for today. The point for today was over here on the right. We have a book, the Brand Serp Guy by Christopher McGuinness. I've got no idea who he is, or Federico Lanzarini. And the book itself, um, it's about pretty much nothing. It's a very vague book about business, doesn't really talk about brand, in fact, it doesn't talk about Brand Serps at all. Very strange, but it has inspired me to write my own book. So I'm currently writing a book all about the fundamentals of Brand Serp management, the Brand Serp guy. And we're gonna see if when we publish that book in October 2021, we can replace this book, which isn't relevant, with a book that I wrote that is. So I'll see you in a couple of months, see if we've done that. Thank you for watching, have fun.